Hello and welcome to this short video where I am going to show you what new features we have for Livecaster. Now is the perfect moment for you to upgrade to the Pro version if you haven't already because we have three new options that you are going to love. The first option is the fact that now you can also uh, publish your videos and post your videos in uh, groups where you are not an administrator. Obviously, you can also post on your friends' timelines, you can also post on the pages that you manage, but you can also post in groups where you are, you are not actually an admin. The second option is the fact that now you can download YouTube videos and afterwards use them however you want. You can download them using Livecaster directly on your computer. You just have to copy and paste the link and I will show you how. And the third option is the fact that now on Facebook is required for the videos that are pre-recorded and that are live streamed to actually uh, have a text on them like a caption or a subtitle which states this video is pre-recorded or this is a demo video or something like that okay you can add like a subtitle so basically let me show you exactly how these new functions are working and we will start with the first one where I'm going to show you how you can stream a video directly into a group where you are not an administrator okay so what you want to do is for example go in the uh, left side menu in the video section where you have all the videos that you want to stream go ahead uh, and select the video that you want to publish in a group as a live cast in a group where you are not an administrator and I will select the second one here you just have to press the go live button okay and here in this pop-up you have to select this option okay and then we will press the insta live button and bear with me for a couple of seconds this uh, window will open in the browser for you press the get stream key button and you will have this option here okay this pop-up where you have to select where you want to share the new video okay and you can see you have more options here including sharing on a friend's timeline in an event page on a page you manage or in a group we will select share in a group and now we have to select a group right and I, I will select a group let's say that we will select this one we'll press the next button okay and a new pop-up will appear for us and we will have to take the stream key from here this is the stream key okay we have to copy it and paste it into livecaster here okay and now we just have to press the go live button okay live video will take some time to show up okay and if we look in the left side menu we can see that in the scheduled options here in the menu we have our new video okay it should start to run very very soon and bear with me for a couple of moments because it will it will start okay now it's running now what I want you to do go back into the browser here in this pop-up press the go live button hello and welcome okay, just leave this page now let's go back in the main browser let's go on Facebook because I want to show you guys how this works okay let's look for our group Udemy coupon guru okay and let's check it out let me just scroll down so you can see my live broadcast here okay this is pretty cool I'm not an administrator of this group my my uh, video is here broadcasting so this works very very well and I, I'm 100% it will be very useful for a lot of you now let me just go back to livecaster I will delete this one because we don't need it I just showed you the example now let's go uh, let's go to the other functions that I want to show you everything that you have to do is go ahead and select the tool section okay and you can see that we have two new options here get video from YouTube and make a video as pre-recorded now let me show you how the first one works I will just go ahead on YouTube okay let's say that I want this video from here to download to my computer okay just copy the link go back to livecaster paste it here select the size okay the video format obviously you probably want the biggest one and then press download invalid vi video URL nope this is not the one let me try with this one okay download it should start 
Now this pop-up will appear where you want to download it. Uh, test Livecaster, you have to give it a name in downloads, test Livecaster, and now you can see that it downloads it for me. Okay, and in a couple of seconds, I will show you exactly uh, where it has downloaded it. Okay, we will have a look at the video so that you can see that this works. Download completed. Let me go to downloads, test. Livecaster. So this is the new video. You can see it's here. Let's open it. Hey, what up, guys? Okay, and it works. So this is how the download function works. Now let's go to the third function, which is add a video so that uh, you can, um, let's say, you can add that piece of text over it. You can see that you can change it here. Let me just select a video, a short one, so that you can see how this works. Promo. Let's see, let's see. Work from home prom. Okay, let's select this one. Now you can put a piece of text here. Demo Livecaster. Okay, you can select the font size. Let's say we want 23. The color, I think the red one. The font, let's say Calibri. And now we press save. It takes some time to complete the process. If you want to continue, click on yes to mark as pre-recorded. Yes. Okay, let's save it on the desktop. Test Live Caster 2. Let's save it. And you can see that the video is in progress. You need to wait while it completes. So bear with me for a couple of seconds. Okay, let's wait for a couple of more seconds. And here it is, our new video. Okay, let me just open for you so you guys can see it. Okay, you can see the caption. Okay, demo livecaster. That's the caption that it's added, okay? And this is very useful because you will need to add that on Facebook if you do not actually broadcast a live video. Okay, and you can put whatever you want in there. So guys, you have seen how the new functions are working. This will be very, very useful for you. So if you haven't upgraded to the pro version of Livecaster, do it right away because as you can see, these three new functions are definitely worth it and they will help you 100%. Now, thank you very much for uh, watching this tutorial. I hope this was helpful for you and I'm looking forward to see you in our next uh, videos with uh, new plugins and new updates. Bye-bye for now. It was Sorin here.